Hello, and welcome to another edition of Thursday Thoughts. I'm Paul Kennedy. I am the rector of Christ Episcopal Church in downtown New Bern, North Carolina. So today is Thursday, the 25th of March in the year 2021, and we have um, been learning how to pivot and change and do things differently for a little over a year now and have had some stops and restarts and learning new spaces and learning how to navigate lots of new things um, during this time. And um, uh, the resiliency of so many people has just been uh, so phenomenal. Uh, this coming Sunday is uh, Palm Sunday, the Passion of Our Lord. Um, a Sunday when, when we start off with this celebration of Jesus entering Jerusalem in great triumph and with great hope uh, for all the people, and we end the service hearing, uh, with many voices, hearing the story of his crucifixion and his death, and we leave the church in silence. I believe that moment was in and of itself a, a great pivot for, uh, for the world. Um, the world has been different ever since the life and death and resurrection of Jesus. Um, and we continue to live into that. So as we approach this coming week, as we approach uh, Palm Sunday, and as we approach Holy Week, and we have Maundy Thursday and Good Friday, um, the, the Easter Vigil and, and Easter Sunday, uh, I invite you to ponder all of those things, all of those ways that, um, that your life may have pivoted in the past years, all the, in the past year, all the ways your life may have shifted and changed. And where was God in that? Because God has never been absent from any of us. Um, even, when, even when we feel God has been absent, maybe God was just being quiet. Uh, but also, God has been with us throughout this entire year in lots and lots of ways. So I'd pon I would encourage you to ponder that. Think about that. Think about where has God been as we, as we have made these pivots um, in our life because of uh, COVID-19. Um, as we've made those pivots, where has God been? Because God was with Jesus as Jesus went into Jerusalem on that Palm Sunday, uh, God was with Jesus uh, in that, that last week when he was teaching in the temple, when he was with his disciples at the Last Supper, when he was on the cross, and certainly at the resurrection. God God never left. And, and things may have seemed hopeless and bleak, and things may have seemed uncertain, and uncertainty could maybe even be worse than hopelessness. I don't know. Um, but but God was present with, with Jesus and with the disciples during all of that. And God has certainly been with us as well. So where has God been for you in the past year? And where have you been able to see God either in the moment or looking back on those times and knowing that God was with you? So that's it. Those are the questions I would encourage you to think about um, as we approach Palm Sunday and Holy Week. Um, if you know me, you know that my, my soundtrack for next week is uh, Jesus Christ Superstar, which tells the whole story of Jesus um, and, and that Passion Week. And, and um, it, it's great music to ponder and great music to, to listen to throughout the week as we prepare for Easter. May God continue to bless you. Uh, wash your hands, wear a mask when you're in public, and if you haven't yet gotten your vaccine, I would so strongly encourage you to do that. I've had both of my doses, and um, everything's great, and I look forward to when everyone has theirs, or as many people as possible can get theirs as well. Take care, and God bless.